Hey guys, what is up? If I look a little familiar right now, it is because I am. I just filmed my Amazon book haul and I am about to film another one. I just wanted to split it up into two videos since it was two unboxings. So I took off my leather jacket and I took my clip out of my hair. So you guys at least have something different to look at than you just looked at for probably 10 minutes or so. But I do have another package here from Book Outlet. The last haul video that I just did was my Amazon unboxing from when I won the $50 gift card from a giveaway that a bunch of new adult authors were doing on Twitter. So this is just a bunch of books that I bought with my own money on Book Outlet that I had kind of been wanting for a while and looked like they were running low on the site so I just decided to go ahead and grab them since why the hell not. So we are just going to go ahead and unbox this. I don't ever buy anything on Book Outlet. Well, I don't ever buy anything on Book Outlet that I didn't already want beforehand and just happen to find on there, except this order does have a couple things in here that I did just see and was like, oh, but I don't normally do that. I usually, it's something I'm looking for and I just happen to check book outlet to see if they have it cheaper than anywhere else, so, yeah. Bye, Felicia. I got Gated and Astray by Amy Christine Parker, and actually I got these, oh, these are the sort of the examples of what I was just talking about. I follow Cassidy on YouTube. I subscribe to her and I watch her videos a lot. She recently did a book outlet haul where she hauled both of these and I thought the covers were super amazing and I was super intrigued by the synopsis the way she gave it. I cannot remember what the synopsis was so I will go ahead and link her video in the description below where she does talk about these books and I will leave like the time mark where she talks about them in case you don't want to watch the whole thing. But you should watch the whole thing because she's super adorable and sweet and I love her a lot. Um, oh, breathe Katie. These are super super beautiful covers and um, as I said before this is Gated and Astray by Amy Christine Parker and they looked super interesting and the covers were really pretty and they were really cheap so I decided I'd grab them. I believe these are um, young adult sort of like maybe dystopian or maybe they're contemporary. I really don't even know to be honest but I grabbed these. So then I also have in here, this is embarrassing, <laughs> Foretold which is one of those like bind ups of a bunch of different stories by different authors and I literally only bought this because it has a Rose and Dimitri story in here um, by Rochelle Mead and if you don't know anything about Vampire Academy those are the, the two love interests in Vampire Academy and there's like a short story written by Rochelle Mead that's in this about the two of them and I read it before but I decided I really just wanted to own it for my crazy vampire academy collection so I have this I'm sure that the other ones are great I don't know that I'll actually read them but I, I at least just wanted the Rose and Dimitri one so I grabbed this plus it was like a dollar so I was like okay how can you turn that down also in here I have After the Rain by Renee Carlino I have several of her other books on my shelf I think I have like three or four of them and I saw this on there so I was like well I was planning on buying it anyway eventually so I might as well grab it I know it takes place on a Montana ranch it's one of those things where you like start the book where you meet the characters and then it's like three years later or something like that it's like it's a romance it's it's new adult and um it has to do with cowboys and ranches and you know that's not usually my typical reading taste so I thought I would grab this and give it a try. I like her writing and I like her books so I grabbed this because it was cheap. The last two books that I have here are by K.A. Tucker and that is Ten Tiny Breaths and Five Ways to Fall. These are from I think technically the series is listed on Goodreads as 10 Tiny Breaths. This is the first book and I think this might be like the third or fourth or fifth or something like that. This one's much thicker than this one. I've heard really amazing things about this book and about K.A. Tucker as an author. These are new adult books and I think it's one of those kind of companion series kind of like most new adult books are. I just grabbed both of these because they were the only two that were on Book Outlet and I know that I'll read them eventually because I had been wanting to read this one anyway and so I picked it up. I don't really know anything about them, uh, so that makes me a bad booktuber, I guess, but I'm really excited to read these. Also, the covers are really pretty, and um, yeah, that's that. So, sorry if that was a really crappy book haul. My battery light started blinking about halfway through, and it's like this is like six minutes long, so I hope you guys enjoyed. These are the books that I got from Book Outlet. I know, I'm in a reading slump and I'm buying books, it doesn't make any sense, but anyway, my update video either has been posted or should be posted soon. If it isn't or hasn't, 
I'll just link it in the description, whether it's been posted or it's going to be posted. I'll link it for you guys. So I hope you guys enjoyed. I will see you all very soon with another video. And yeah, goodbye.